brothers and sisters in faith Will Durant a non-believer he said if we rated greatness by the influence of the great we will say Muhammad is the greatest of the great in history yes brothers Gustave Le Bon a French historian he said he said Muhammad is the greatest man history ever knew a non-believer this is our leader George Bernard Shaw he said the world is much in need of Muhammad's bright thinking such a man assume the leadership and the rule of the modern world he would have succeed in solving its problems and bringing peace and and bringing peace and happiness to it this is our messenger and this is what great thinkers are saying this is what the intellect the intellectuals are saying and brothers and sisters they are non-believers Lamartine Lamartine a French philosopher he said in all standards by which human greatness is measured we will ask is there any man greater than Muhammad is there any man greater than Muhammad my brothers and sisters in faith as for Michael Hart the author of the hundred most influential persons in history as for him Muhammad is number one why because yes Muhammad is from Al-Haq Muhammad is from Allah his message to the world is La ilaha illallah Alhamdulillah Alhamdulillah Alladhi lam yattakhiz waladan wa lam yakul lahu shariqun fil mulki wa ma kana ma'ahu min ilah Alhamdulillah Alladhi khalaqa al-samawati wal-arda wa ja'ala al-zulumati wal-nura thumma al-lazina kafaru birabbihim ya'adilun Alhamdulillah Alladhi anzala ala abdihi al-kitaba wa lam yaj'al lahu iwaja الحمد لله فاطر السماوات والأرض جاعل الملائكة رسلا أولي أجنحة مثنى وثلاث ورباع يزيد في الخلق ما يشاء إن الله على كل شيء قدير الحمد لله وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له في أرضه وسمائه وأشهد أن محمدا عبده ورسوله وصفيه من خلقه وخليل القائل إني لم أبعث لعانا وإنما بعثت رحمة اللهم صل وسلم وبارك عليه وعلى اله وصحبه العتقياه البرره وعلى من هذا هذوهم وسلك سبيلهم الى يوم الدين وبعد my dear brother and my dear sister Allah is الباعث the awakener Allah Allah is al-ba'ithu the one who resurrects Allah he is al-ba'ithu the one who will give life to the dead Allah he is al-ba'ithu because he is the only truth ذَلِكَ بِأَنَّ اللَّهَ هُوَ الْحَقَّ yes he is al-ba'ithu the resurrector because he is the only truth and he is the only one who has the power to revive the dead to bring the dead back to life he is one I bear witness he is one in his kingdom 
and absolutely no doubt about it, he deserved to be worshipped alone. I bear witness. My dear brother, and my dear sister, attention. He was in Ghar Hira, the cave of Hira. And an angel came to him and said to him, Ikra, read, recite. He replied, Ma anabi qari. I do not know how to read. He said, Fa'akhodhani, fa'gottani, hatta balagha minni al-juhd, thumma arusalani fa'qala qra. Then, he held me, forcibly, and pressed me hard, until I felt distress, thumma arsalani, and he let me go. He said, Ikra, recite. I said, Ma ana biqari. I do not know how to read. He said, Fa akhadani fa ghattani thaniyata hatta balagha minni al juhd, thumma arsalani fa qala ikra. He held me the second time forcibly impress me hard until I felt so distressed then he let me go he said recite the second time I said I do not know how to read then he held me forcibly the third time he pressed me so hard and he released me and said, Read. Ikra, recite. Ikra, read. Bismi rabbika alladhi khalaqa. Read in the name of your Lord who created you. Khalaqa al-insana min alaqa. He created the human being. The clot. From a clot. Ikra wa rabbuka al-akram. Read. And your Lord is the most bounteous. And your Lord is the most generous. The one who taught by the pen. He taught human being. He taught human being what he did not know. Right there, the angel disappeared. And he ran. He ran to his family and said, Zammiluni, Zammiluni, cover me, cover me. Brothers and sisters in faith, when the state of fear was over, he said, Ay Khadija to Mali. Oh, my dear wife Khadija, what is happening to me? What is wrong with me? Lakad khashi to ala nafsi. I fear for myself. I am afraid that something bad may happen, might happen to me. And he narrated to her what he saw in the cave of Hira. Brothers and sisters in faith. When he narrated to his lovely wife Khadija radiallahu anha what happened to him in the cave of Hira of what he saw. Please, listen to her respond. And to whoever is seeking for the truth. Please listen. To Khadija radiallahu anha. She said, Kella, Absher. No, 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 no way. Impossible. Absher, be happy. <coughs> For wallahi la yukhzikallahu abada. By Allah, by Allah, Allah will never disgrace you. 
Why are you so sure, Ya Khadija? Now listen to these brothers. Listen, and to whoever is looking for the truth, who's seeking for the truth, who wants to know the truth, listen to the testimony. Listen to Khadija. She said, Innaka natasiru rahima. You keep good relations with your family. You enjoy the family ties. And you speak the truth. Ya Allah. Count it. Keep counting. And you bear people's burdens. You carry people's burdens on you. You always want people to be happy. You always want to make things easy for people. Oh. Another one, brothers and sisters in faith, she said to him, and you help the destitute and the poor. You help the destitute and, and the poor. What took daifa? And you entertain your guests generously. You make your guests always feel at home. And you help, you assist those who are affected by calamity. This is our prophet. This is our master. This is our role model. This is our teacher. This is our heart. This is our love. And the name is Muhammad. Muhammad Rasulullah. Muhammad. The messenger of Allah. This is our heart. Muhammad is our heart. And the name is Muhammad. Yes, the name is Muhammad. مَا كَانَ مُحَمَّدٌ أَبَا أَحَدٍ مِنْ رِجَالِكُمْ The name is Muhammad. وَمَا مُحَمَّدٌ إِلَّا رَسُولٌ The name is Muhammad. Yes. The name is Muhammad. وَالَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَعَمِلُوا الصَّالِحَاتِ وَآمَنُوا بِمَا نُزِّلَ عَلَى مُحَمَّدٍ مُحَمَّدٌ رَسُولُ اللَّهِ This is our master. This is our heart. This is our role model. This is our teacher. This is our leader. He is free from all faults. He is pure and clean. Yes, brothers and sisters in faith. His Lord, His Creator, Allah, Allah, praise Him by saying, No, well, call me, This is our master. No. Allah said, I swear by the pen. And what they write. By the grace of your Lord, you are not insane. No. وَإِنَّ لَكَ لَأَجْرٌ غَيْرَ مَمْنُونَ And most surely, and most surely, you will have never-ending reward. وَإِنَّ لَكَ لَعَلَى خُلُكٍ عَظِيمٌ And you are a man of most excellent character, Muhammad. This is our messenger. This is our prophet. This is our leader. This is our role model. Brothers and sisters in faith, the history noted him as a great man. 
the intellects, the intellectuals, the great thinkers noted him as the greatest of the great Muhammad, our messenger. Brothers and sisters in faith, Will Durant, a non-believer, he said, if we rated greatness by the influence of the great, we will say Muhammad is the greatest of the great in history. Muhammad, this is our leader. He is our heart. Yes, brothers. Gustave Le Bon, a French historian, he said, he said, Muhammad is the greatest man history ever knew. A non-believer. This is our leader. George Bernard Shaw, he said, the world is much in need of Muhammad's bright thinking. Such a man assume the leadership and the rule of the modern world, he would have succeed in solving its problems and bringing peace and, and bringing peace and happiness to it. This is our messenger. And this is what great thinkers are saying. This is what the intellect, the intellectuals are saying. And brothers and sisters, they are non-believers. They are not believers. Brothers and sisters, Lamartine, Lamartine, a French philosopher, he said, in all standards by which human greatness is measured, we will ask, is there any man greater than Muhammad? Hal hunaka man huwa afdalu minan nabiyya Muhammad? Is there any man greater than Muhammad? This is our master. This is our heart. Muhammadun Rasulullah. Muhammad the messenger of Allah. My brothers and sisters in faith, as for Michael Hart, the author of the hundred most influential persons in history, as for him, Muhammad is number one. Why? Because yes, Muhammad is from Al-Haq. Muhammad is from Allah. His message to the world is La ilaha illallah. Kul innama yuha ilayya annama ilahukum ilahu wahid fahal antum muslimun. His message to the world is there is no God but Allah and that was the message of Nuh alayhi salam. His message to the world is la ilaha illallah and that was the message of Abraham. Muhammad's message to the world is la ilaha illallah, there is no God but Allah and that was the message of Jacob. That was the message of Isaac. That was the message of Ishmael. Muhammad's message to the world is la ilaha illallah and that was the message of Moses. Muhammad's message to the world is la ilaha illallah and that was the message of Jesus peace be upon him yes this is our master in case you don't know now you know this is our role model and his message to the world brothers and sisters is irhamu man fil ardi yarhamkum man fil sama Muhammad's message to the world is have mercy on those on the earth and the one above will have mercy on you. This is our master. And this is his teaching. He taught us love. He taught us faith. He taught us love. And he taught us peace. Our master, Muhammad, the messenger of Allah. Yes. He said, لا تدخل الجنة حتى تؤمنوا ولا تؤمنوا حتى تهابوا He said, you will never enter paradise until you believe and you will not believe until you love each other Should I tell you what will make you love each other? Spread peace, this is our teacher أفشو السلام بينكم Spread peace among you, among you Among yourselves This is the teaching of our teacher and he is our heart. We love him so much. We love him more than we love ourselves. We love Muhammad Rasulullah more than we love our mothers and fathers and children and health and wealth. 
We love him more than everything. Let's give the world the example of his love in our hearts. The parable of the love of our beloved prophet Muhammad in our hearts. In a battlefield, a lady's father was killed. In a battlefield, same lady's son was killed. In the battlefield, same lady's brother was killed. All were killed. When she was told, what happened? She was told, you lost your father, brother, and son. She said, what happened to the messenger of Allah? They said, Khaira, he is fine. He is okay as you wish. She said, no, no, no. Take me to him. I want to see him. I'm not okay yet. And when she saw the blessed face of the Prophet Muhammad, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, she said, yes, I lost my father. Yes, I lost my brother. Yes, I lost my son. But as long as you are okay, nothing happened to you. All those calamities are minor. This is our master. This is how much we love him. He is our heart. We love him so much because brothers and sisters in faith, his message to the world Believe me, even if you are not a believer, even if you are not a Muslim and you have good heart, you will love our leader. Yeah, if you have a good heart, if you love mercy, you will love Muhammad. If you love peace, you will love Muhammad. If you love truth, you will love Muhammad. If you love justice, you will love Muhammad. If you love freedom, and equality, you will love Muhammad. This is our leader, Muhammad, the messenger of Allah. His message to the world is mercy. He was asked, Ya Rasulullah, invoke curse on the disbelievers, the pagans. He said, Inni lam ana. I have not been sent as an invoker of curse to people. But I was sent as a mercy to humankind. Yes, this is our messenger. Brothers and sisters in faith, the day of the opening of Mecca, when he guarded all the kuffar of Mecca, those who treated him badly, those who threw him out of his birthplace, Mecca, they forcibly removed him from Mecca. He ran away from Mecca due to the punishment. When Allah brought him back victoriously, when he gathered them, he said, Ya Ahla Mecca, ma tadunnuna anni sani'un bikum, ma tadunnuna anni fa'ilun bikum. Oh, people of Mecca, what do you think today I'm going to do to you? They said, Khaira, good. Good? Why are you saying good after all that you did to him? They said, good. Akhun kareemun wabnu akhun kareem. Uh, a generous brother and the son of a generous brother you never pay evil with evil and this is one of his description in Torah even before he was born this is our leader he never pay back evil with evil but rather he forgives and overlook this is our leader this is Muhammad for those who don't know if you want to know the truth, this is our leader. His message to the world, maybe you did not hear. But please, come with an open heart. Open your heart and you will hear the message of Muhammad to the world. Please open your heart. قُلْ تَعَالَوْا أَتْلُوا مَا حَرَّمَ رَبُّكُمْ عَلَيْكُمْ أَلَّا تُشْرِكُوا بِهِ شَيْئًا وَبِالْوَالِدَيْنِ إِحْسَانًا this is the message of Muhammad. Come, come. He said, come. Allah said, tell them, Ya Muhammad, this is the message. This is what I sent you to tell them. This is the message I sent you to give to the world. Tell them. Ta'alaw, come. I will recite what your Lord has forbidden. 
Allah tushriku bihi shay'a Number 1 do not associate a partner with him wa bil walidayni ihsana and be good to your parents and be kind to your parents wa la taqtulu auladakum min imlaq and do not kill your children for the fear of poverty nahnu narzuqukum wa iyyahum we will provide for you and them ولا تقرب الفواحش ما ظهر منها وما بطن and do not draw near shameful deeds be it in public or in secret ولا تقتلوا النفس التي حرم الله and do not kill innocent soul do not kill the life that Allah has made sacred this is the message of Muhammad if you don't know now you know Do not kill the life that Allah has made sac- sacred illa bil haqq except by the law This is the message of Muhammad and this is the message of all the messengers and the prophets Zalikum wasakum bi la'allakum taqilun This is what Allah commanded you to do this is what Allah sent me to tell you so that you me learn wisdom take more open your heart if you want to know who our leader is muhammad wala taqrabu mal al-yatim illa billati hiya ahsan hatta yablugha shudda wa awfu al-kayl wal mizan bil qist la nukallifu nafsan illa wus'aha wa idha kuntum fa'dilu wa bi walaw kana dha quba wa bi ahdi Allah awfu dhalikum wasaqu bihi la'allakum tadhakkarun this is the message this is the message of muhammad He never hurt anyone. He said Allah commanded me, Allah sent me to tell you do not go near the wealth of the of the orphan. Speak the truth. When you are weighing something give full measure and weigh with justice. Speak the truth even if it's against your own family, your your your, your closest your close relatives. This is the message of Muhammad. He never hurt anyone. He never harmed anyone. His message to the world is peace. His message to the world is love. His message to the world is faith in God. His message to the world is hope. He taught us love, peace and hope. Brothers and sisters, this is our messenger who has nothing to hide. He is clean, free from all faults. خلقت مبرا من كل عيب كانك قد خلقت كما تشاء. والله واحسن منك لم تر قط عيني واجمل منك لم تلد النساء no woman has ever given birth to a personality like muhammad this is our messenger very clean very pure he has nothing to hide yes and we love him so much اقول قولي هذا واستغفر الله لي ولكم الحمد لله وكفى وسلام على عباده الذين اصطفى All thanks are due to Allah the one and only the supreme and the most high. My dear brother and my dear sister, yes, this is our prophet. He in all his judgments are excellent and accurate. All his talks are excellent and accurate. All his actions are excellent and accurate. Do you know why? Because he never speaks of his desire, but rather whatever comes from him is from Allah. Didn't you hear? وَالنَّجْمِ إِذَا هَوَى مَا ضَلَّ صَاحِبُكُمْ وَمَا غَوَى وَمَا يَنطِقُ عَنِ الْهَوَى إِنْ هُوَ إِلَّا وَحْيٌ يُوحَى Whatever comes from him, whatever comes from Muhammad is from Allah. He is a messenger, a mercy to the whole world. This is our role model. and he is our heart and we love him so dearly we love him more than we love our personal selves we love him more than we love our mothers and fathers and wealth we love him more than we love our children 
We love him because he taught us love. He paved the way for us all the way to heaven. He paved the way for us all the way to the kingdom of Allah. He paved the way to us for us to success in this world and the hereafter. So if you want to know our prophet, please read and ask the history. Ask the intellectuals. Ask the great thinkers. Believe me, like I said earlier, even if you are not a Muslim and you have good hearts, you will love Muhammad. Wallahi al-Azim, I swear by Allah, open your heart, just read. Even if you are not a Muslim, just read about Muhammad. Learn about Muhammad, you will love him. His message to the world is equality. Sincere equality, true equality, yes. يا أيها الناس إنا خلقناكم من ذكر وأنثى وجعلناكم شعوبا وقبائل لتعارفوا إن أكرمكم عند الله أتقاكم This is the message of Muhammad That yes, we are all the same The Arab ليس لعربي فضل على أعجمي ولا لأعجمي فضل على عربي ولا لأحمر على أسود ولا لأسود على أحمر إلا بالتقوى This is the message of Muhammad Allah said we created you in male and female Male and female And we made you into nations and tribes So that you may recognize each other But the best among you is he who fears Allah the most And the Prophet Muhammad said in his hadith In his sunnah That the Arab has no superiority over the non-Arab And the non-Arab has no superiority over the Arab The white man has no superiority over the black And the black man has no superiority over the white man Oh, except with taqwa Except with the fear of Allah This is true equality So he taught us peace Peace to women, love, and good treatment to women. Muhammad, the emancipator of women. Muhammad came and freed women from all the shackles, from all the burdens. He carried all for them. Yes, he came and freed women. Women, this is the message of our beloved prophet Muhammad. This is the message of Islam. So if you don't know, and in case you don't know, now you know. This is Muhammad. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. May Allah increase his love in our heart. Brothers and sisters, educate people about the Prophet Muhammad. Let people understand who he is. Wallahi, they will love him. They will love him. He is the man of an outstanding character, great moral character, our Prophet Muhammad. May Allah increase his love in our heart. Ya Allah, we love him. We want to see him, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, make us see him in Jannah. Ya Allah, make us meet our beloved Prophet Muhammad in Jannah. Ya Allah, let the world understand who Muhammad is, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, let them understand and know the importance of Muhammad to the world. Ya Allah, let them know the teachings of Muhammad. Ya Allah, open their heart and let them understand that our Prophet is peace and love. Muhammadun, Rasulullah Allah, we pray that you cure all the sick ones. All our brothers and sisters, those in the hospital, those even walking with the sickness but they don't even know. Ya Allah, we pray that you grant all shifa. Ya Allah, heal us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, heal us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, no one heals but you, Ya Allah. We seek your Allah, your help. Ya Allah, heal us, cure us. Ya Allah, we are sick, and Allah, you know, and you are a shafi. Heal us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, forgive our mothers and fathers, our parents, our loved ones. Ya Allah, increase your love and the love of our beloved Prophet Muhammad in our hearts. Ya Allah, make us love you and the Prophet more than anything. Ya Allah, always increase your love and the love of our beloved Prophet Muhammad in our hearts. Ya Allah, we pray that you bless our children. Ya Allah, we pray that you bless our, you bless our congregations. Ya Allah, we pray that whoever is looking for job here, I pray may Allah grant you good job. Those with businesses, I pray may Allah continue to bless your businesses. May Allah forgive us our sin. Allah اللهم اهدنا فيمن هديت وعافنا فيمن عافيت وتولنا فيمن توليت وبارك لنا فيما اعطيت وقنا شر ما قضيت اللهم اهدنا واهد بنا واجعلنا سببا لمن اهتدى ولا حول ولا قوه الا بالله العلي العظيم وصل اللهم وسلم وبارك على عبدك ونبيك محمد وعلى اله وصحبه اجمعين وقوموا الى صلاتكم